in the previous lesson of power meditation and combination we discussed some basic skills required to understand them and we learned the multiplication uh, we learned the fundamental principle of multiplication and now we're going to talk the another fundamental principle of counting that is uh, fundamental principle of addition and let me first write the statement and then i will make you understood by an example okay uh, the fundamental principle of uh, addition states something like this if there are two events that can happen independently that can occur independently in m and n different ways then either of the two event can occur in m plus n ways all right so if there are two events that can occur independently in m ways and n different ways then either of the two events can occur in m plus n ways let me uh, let me give you the same uh, example that i had given you uh, in the last video that boy and girl all right so there was a school and in the school there were 10 boys in a class let's say and 15 girls all right and this time let's say a uh, teacher is not going to make two monitor uh, the teacher is going to make one monitor all right so there is one seat just one seat and the seat is for the monitor and now the teacher want to uh, appoint one monitor out of this 10 boys and 15 girls so all together there are uh, 25 10 plus 25 students and uh, it can be anyone you know the monitor can be boy the monitor can be girl because girls are equally nowadays <laughs> okay so here may be a boy monitor or maybe a girl monitor and if the monitor is boy then there are 10 ways of selecting boys or 10 out of 10 boys anyone can be and similarly if there is a uh, if there will be a girl then there are 15 girls so from 15 girl anyone can be the monitor so all together there are 25 candidates for one seat keep in mind all right it's just like an election <laughs> okay so there are 25 candidates for one seat it means there are 25 ways there are 25 methods for selecting one monitor the teacher will get really fatigue uh, who one will be the uh, the monitor people should vote <laughs> Anyway, so just I was trying to say that this is the fundamental principle of addition. All right. If there are two events that can occur independently in M and N different ways, just like here, we can select one boy out of this 10 independently in 10 different ways. And we can select one girl out of this 15 independently in 15 ways. Uh, then the either of the two events can occur in M plus N ways. Yes. And so if we're going to select one from this, both of the uh, both of the events, you know, from the both of the boy, boys group or the girls group right if we are just going to select one not from only boys not from only girls then that time the total possible will be the addition of this and addition of this that is 25 different ways all right this is the fundamental principle of addition i hope you understand it and this is really going to help us a lot who are learning the permutation and combination all right so let's go to some examples and after that we'll be talking about the factorial all right and then we'll start the permutation the real permutation and then combination